Hello everybody, my name is Alex and welcome to Powerplay. Today we're going to be going over Valkyrie cameras on the new map theme park. So we're going to be starting off in the Haunted Dining Room and the Gargoyle Room. It's really hard for me to say that word for some reason. So we are going to be using Bomb for this simply because of the fact that these Bomb locations and secure areas, the cans will work for both, just kind of keep that in mind. This first one, you want to come into this red room and come to the, this wall over here and shoot in the top left corner. You want to make sure you use your Deagle for this, it's just going to take out walls a lot faster. And throw your camera up towards the top. And the reason why I like this one is I'm actually watching two hallways now and two doorways that are the main entrances into this room that we're trying to secure or hold down. So the smaller you make this hole, the less likely it will be seen, but you sometimes you do need it to be bigger so you can get a better view of everything. So here I made my hole a little bit bigger and I can actually see both doorways going into my room. And here's actually what it looks like from the other side. So you actually still have this pillar here. Now, if you're not constantly spotting with the camera, it's actually going to be very hard to see. Not too many people are really going to be looking for it, so kind of keep that in mind. So this next one is a high traffic area, and this is going to be the main train area into the park or into pretty much the entire area itself. This goes everywhere, so it's a high traffic area. This first one is at the very middle of the room at the top of the arch. This one is actually going to be most likely seen if you are spotting from it because it is very obvious to throw it all the way up here, but I just want to show you guys. This next one though, in the same room, is on the north side and you want to throw it up onto this window. The reason why I like this one is for a couple reasons. One, it's going to be harder to see. Two, you can actually see outside as you can see here. I can see outside onto that hatch and where people are going to be coming in from. And three, I still have all of the area I can see. And here's what it looks like from the outside. It's very hard to see the cam, but yet I could still see you from my camera if you are out here. That's the reason why I like this one so much. So this next one is going to be on drug storage. So this one is actually not going to be looking at an entire room, more a doorway. So the reason why I like this one is it's very hard to see and if you're with a team that communicates, this camera spot could be very great for you. So we're going to be here in this main room by this red couch and I actually throw this first one a little bit too far. You want to keep your camera a little bit in line or just behind that armrest there. So, and the reason why I like this camera is I'm actually looking at this main doorway into this room. And this is actually a main area and usually one of the first places that people go to on this map. So, another reason why I like it. So, if you keep your camera in line with that armrest, I'm actually going to show you here. You're going to get a great line of sight of that doorway. So, again, if you're communicating with your team, this spot could be very useful and just kind of limit people and where people can come from. And you can see that entire doorway, which is why I like it. So this next one that we're going to go to is actually a very simple spot as well. We're going to go back to this main hallway that we started off at the very beginning, but this time instead of breaking the wall, you're going to throw your camera on the opposite side of that wall by the air vent in this black corner. The reason why I like this one is simply because of the fact that it's in a dark area, not too many people can really see it, but I can still see your legs and I can see the entire hallway. And this is also kind of a high traffic area because you have the stairs off to your left. So this next one, we're going to be going into the office and initiation room. This one is actually a very simple spot. I was kind of experimenting with a couple things here, so you're going to see me melee a couple things that I was like, oh, maybe these can break. I was kind of curious. Unfortunately, they do not break. They just, they're solid. You can't break them. So this camera is actually going to be not, kind of a half a room diameter of what you can see. So this one, throw it into the cabinet. And like I said, is you can't see the entire room with this one, but you can narrow down where the enemy would be if they are in the room. So if you are in bomb, I can kind of eliminate where they might be depending on where the bomb location is. This next one is actually another doorway watch. So this one, another high traffic area into this room. You want to throw your camera into the backside of this corner. And it's kind of hidden by these little leaves too, which is also nice. But this one, this room is a very high traffic area for people coming into the building because it's a one simple room and there's not too many other ways that you, they can be shot from so this one looking at a main doorway and that's why i like it so if you're patient you can use this one to your advantage so next one we're gonna be going daycare and park at uh, bark this simple one not a very complicated area and this one might be seen but it's still very useful is you're going to kind of lock off the rest of the room here. I can't really see the entire room, but my camera is also guarded from the left side, so I can watch main doorway into the room, but also watch some of the other things around it. So I can kind of eliminate where they might be, depending on where my camera location is at. So thank you very much for watching, guys. It's greatly appreciated. If you use any other Valkyrie cameras on this map and other better spots that I did maybe missed or just missed in general, please just let me know down in the comments down below because I always like to figure out where some great Valkyrie camera spots could be. I do have a couple other ones on this map, but some of them were kind of mediocre. They weren't like the best spots in the world. These were just some of my favorites. So thank you guys for watching. It is greatly appreciated. And see you guys next week for another episode.